going on everybody out there on the internet? My name is Fred Angel. Welcome back to Star Wars The Old Republic. Last time we left off, what were we doing? We were doing, uh... <coughs> Excuse me. We were doing, uh, what, we did Galactic Starfighter? And now we are trying to find Kira Carson. Right? I believe so. Alright, so we're gonna go try to save this woman who's in trouble. She's in trouble and she needs our help. Hey, good on her, I guess, for, uh, I don't know. She's probably got herself in trouble. Now she needs, now she needs my help, even though she was, she went on, she, you know what? She shouldn't have went on her own. But you know what? I respect it. I respect it because she probably stopped them from stealing this senator or whoever the hell it is. So you know what? I'll give you props for that at least. At least you were on the case. Just in time. These guys get points for courage, but we're a little outnumbered. There's more than a few trigger-happy thugs in that docking bay. The kidnappers are threatening to kill Dr. Tarnas, but they might be bluffing. I'm not even sure they have him. Are they open to the possibility of surrender? Tried negotiating with the leader. He shot at me. Very rude. So, how do we handle this? I'll deal with this alone. You stay here. Don't do that. I may be a Padawan, but I know a few tricks. I borrowed a stealth field generator from Agent Galen's office. Makes me practically invisible. I can sneak in first, then when you attack, I'll take a few thugs by surprise. What do you think? That suits me just fine. Great. Now you see me, now you don't. Oh, wow, she's a I'll sage. Position and attack on your signal. Let's rescue us a doctor. Let's go, girl. Very convenient that you go invisible. Again, I wish I was playing an invisible class, but I'm not. But you know what? It'll be all right. Because we're playing a tank, and it'll be really hard to kill us. At least whenever we're just playing these low level quests when we're over leveled by like what five levels six levels now I love this lightsaber man our character looks bad ass <laughs> wow she can stay invisible though that's OP Oh, nice shot. <laughs> My friggin' lightsaber is so awesome. Did I train my moves? I didn't train my moves. I said I was gonna go train my moves and then I didn't, did I? I remember saying that yesterday. Yeah, I didn't even train them. My goodness. Now, where's the senator? I don't see him. It's Kira. What the hell? Ugh, Jedi scum! I'll kill you someday. He sure killed my stealth field generator. Oh well, it was fun while it lasted. Isn't teamwork grand? You handled yourself like a true Jedi, Kira. Wait, I need a hollow of that. I want to play it back for Master Kowix. No sign of Dr. Tarnas. Kind of puts a damper on things. We were the decoys. Now you'll never see your little doctor again. Is that so? Give me a minute with this guy. I'll make him talk. If nothing else, this will be entertaining. Thanks for the encouragement. Thing is, we don't need him to talk. Not when I can just read his mind. What? what? Stop that! Get out of my head! Get out! The doctor's in the Black Sun headquarters. Salar has him. Just leave me alone. Cheap thugs will believe anything. I can't read your mind, stupid. You... you tricked me! Wow. What an idiot. Smooth, Kira. Very smooth. Black Sun is a major crime syndicate. Whatever they want with Tarnas, we'd better save him quick. Me and my security detail will clean this up. Agent Galen will want to hear about this. Understood. All right. Yeah, for a second there, I was like, wait a second. You can read minds now, too? You got equipment that can turn you invisible, and you can read minds. Like, what? Like... How can I play as you? Screw this character. That'd be so awesome if you could, there was like a read mind ability. I mean, there's like abilities that like 
do mind stuff, but they're really just stuns, and it stuns people. Oh, I have to go back and speak with the agent. All right, I don't want to travel all the way there. I'm going to go ahead and travel all the way to the Senate Tower. And I need to remember to train, because this is going to level me up, too. We're going to hit 18, and then one more level after that, and we get our freaking next utility point. Heck yeah. Heckin' yeah, man. All right. I love the music in this game, dude. It gets me so nostalgic and just... It fills you with that good Star Wars... Just... The Star Wars feeling, man. I can feel the midichlorians creeping up my arms. Onto my fingertips. Dr. Tarnas is the least of our worries, General. The stolen data files had details, not only on the planet prison, but every weapon prototype and research facility in existence. Our most powerful experimental weapons, and Black Sun has access to them. How could this happen? What does Black Sun stand to gain? They could make a fortune selling secrets to our enemies. We must act quickly to secure these other weapons. Where are they? Three off-world research facilities. Minimal defenses to give them a low profile. They're vulnerable. Esther Kiewicz and I will split up and protect two. And I'll take the third one. You get the fun part. Rescuing Dr. Tarnas and the copied data files from Black Sun. We'll be back in time for dinner. Hero will stay behind too. With Agent Galen leaving, her computer talents will be needed. She can be impulsive, but give her a chance. You'll make a good team. I hope that turns out to be the case. Kira is a good person. She simply needs strong guidance. We should go. May the Force be with us all. I'll escort you to your ships, my friends. Before I go, I'm putting all my resources at your disposal. There's a special tactical unit in Black Sun Territory. Experienced security officers who've been fighting those gangsters for months. Go to these coordinates. Talk to Sergeant Nidaljo. He can help you rescue Dr. Tarnas and get those copied data files. Your man better have a strong stomach. Those gangsters are gonna learn the meaning of pain. They're already familiar with that topic. Don't underestimate the Black Sun gang. They enjoy killing, and they're good at it. Kira's on her way. I'll get her plugged into our security network before I leave. Good luck. Aye, aye, Captain. Aye, aye. Wow, none of these are better than what I got. Level 18. Booyah. Do we get anything new? We got Focus Striking. It's a passive. Reduces the cooldowns of Sundering Strike and Warding Strike by three seconds each and increases the focus they generate. Which is Warding Strike? Okay, so this one, and then what was the other one? Sundering. Where's Sundering Strike? I don't know if I have Sundering Strike. I do not have Sundering Strike. Maybe that is something I get later. But all right, it reduces the cooldown of the Warding Strike. So it'll be the, what, 13 seconds now? If it was three seconds reduced. Heck yeah. All right. Oh wait, what's that? Patak. Wait, there's a purple one. Now, there's two different colored quest indicators. There's the yellow one, which kind of means they're just kind of a side quest. And then the purple ones have to do with story. So we'll always do the purple quest. So I'll, good thing I looked at my map before I left because I would have missed that. So yeah, any type of, I guess it's like a purpley pink type of quest, we will always pick those up and do those because they're story based, like the general story, not just some side quest. Yeah, the story arc of Coruscant. Yeah, we definitely need this one. Senator, please comprehend. Repairing Coruscant's infrastructure is green obtuse. To form the red parallel, we require a black bisector. Oh, this is pointless. I can't understand a word you're saying. I use mistaken words and request patience. This will be clearer. The lower levels are alarming and filled with casualties. Active collaborators can solve problems. Oh, I give up. Do you have any idea what this ambassador droid is trying to say? Why approach me? I don't know. Even the protocol droids can't decipher these speech patterns. I'm at my wit's end. I'm Senator Oranda. This is Patike from the Gree Enclave. Before you ask, the Gree are remote people, isolationist. They help build Coruscant's original infrastructure. We asked for assistance with repairs, they sent the droids. What sort of infrastructure needs repairing? Power, water, and waste reprocessing. 
things the world needs to survive. The war left a lot of Coruscant in bad shape. The Enclave bargains resources and offers reversal of Coruscant's yellow concave. We commit to White Vertex to achieve this. Gree droids seem to speak in Gree patterns, so this gibberish is what I've got to rebuild Coruscant with. I speak attentively in hopes of comprehension. The bargain encounters great challenges. My delegates suffer assault affecting the maintenance, fire, damage, and fear. Do you follow? No. No, I freaking idea. You're not making any sense at all. My exertion to speak attentively has tangibly failed. Should I formulate new statements? Coruscant needs these repairs to continue functioning. Patake, you have to convince your delegates to brave these dangers. Impossible. My delegates require aid from one accustomed to fire, damage, and chaos. A black bisector, you see? Allow me to do this. I will compensate the Black Bisector with useful and valued items only available from the Enclave. My delegates will describe their Black Spheres for you. These are bold, courageous mission callings. Speak to them and learn. Speak to them and learn. Everything ends with a K. Some weird droids, man. Never going back. Never going back to Blue Nonagon. Now I am Yellow Concave. Injuries mark my chassis forever, and why? Ungrateful humans. How were you damaged? Fire, smoke, blades. The occupants of Level Below committed numerous assaults. My safe return was improbable, never going back. Coruscant's life waters are sluggish, stagnant. Padake commanded me. Go to the Level Below, repair the broken hydro supply, make clean life waters flow. I crafted a solution to achieve Padake's command. All was orange sphere until I arrived at the Level Below, then green perpendicular. Green perpendicular? Man, this is... I... What? You're not making any sense at all. I renew my atonement efforts and acknowledge your patience with this idea exchange. Hadake failed to impart the lethal conflict enemies waiting on the level below. Many weapons and offenders despising my arrival. I fled Black Sun with my crafted solution intact, but the repair progresses unresolved. Coruscant's life waters remain sluggish, stagnant, without repairs. The Hydra Supply must have my crafted solution. Can I take your crafted solution to the Hydro Supply? You offer yourself as a Black Bisector. That is a gratifying, unpredicted announcement. I pledge to provide items of Gree Ingenuity in return. Take and apply my crafted solution to the Hydro Supply, but do not apply before deactivating nearby flow valves, or pressure explosion death will result. Be alerted. Black Sun Green Perpendicular will provide onslaught. May you experience Blue Tangent and return intact. Yeah. Yeah, whatever you guys are saying, blue, blue tangent, blue, comp, orange colors, I don't, who the heck knows. All right, no, no, that's over. Jeez. Jeez Louise. All right. Well, that was an interesting conversation. So yeah, any type of purple quests we get, gonna do those because they are story arc oriented. Um, again, I, I will do a lot of the side missions like heroics and just every random things every now and again, but not all of them, because there are a lot of them. There's some planets that take a long time to do every quest on. I freaking love this rat. <coughs> Ugh, sorry for my coughs, guys. I'm my my body is trying to get all the all the nastiness out right now, and that's the point of my sickness I'm in. Using a light it's not really sick just anymore, it's just science trying to get it trying to get it all out. Alright, what do we get? We got her a heroic moment. Um, every class gets a heroic moment. It's a ability, it's got a pretty long cooldown, five minutes. But you can basically use like a bunch of these overpowered skills and you like regenerate health over time and it's kinda like a it's like a big cooldown if you got like a big boss that you need to kill. And then I got freezing force. Just the movement thing and then guard. Which guard we're going to keep on our companion at all times. Because they take less damage and generate less threat. So they'll all be on me. So he can be unbothered and they will all attack me. And then a lot of the damage they take is also directed at me though. Which could be a problem. But, you know, it is what it is. You know what? I'm a... I kind of want to travel back there because I, I think I forgot a quest back there. I don't have a safe and oh, whoops, I didn't really... Okay. Well, I didn't want to fly there right now, but 
this Crisis in Galactic City quest I need to turn in. I did it. Apparently I forgot to turn it in. Somewhere. Somehow. Somewhere, somehow. Um, so yeah, these conquests, we might do at later levels. Um, conquests are basically like daily or weekly objectives that you can do. And then there's some repeatable ones, I think, that give you uh, experience points, credits, and they give you like some, like a bunch of other bonus, I don't know, they give you like conquest points and you get like crafting materials for them. And it's basically their... There are challenges you can do all over the world, or the, the galaxy. There's like operations, so complete an operation, do starfighter stuff, flashpoint stuff, go to Voss and do stuff there. So it's a cool way to send you all over the galaxy, which I appreciate. I like games that like make up reasons for higher levels to go back to like old, old zones, which is kind of what uh, like Legion did for World of Warcraft. They Legion did that for a little bit where you went back for a lot of your class story stuff. I've always liked that in video games, man. Where is this quest at? Oh, it's like right out here. Okay. That ain't too bad. That ain't too bad, Chad. I've been playing a lot of Red Dead Redemption 2 because it just came out on Steam on PC and I just I keep wanting to talk like a cowboy like, yeah, there, boy. I man can't believe you took on all those gangsters and lived. You're a blasted hero, you know that? With the network terminals locked down, the speeder traffic is secure. Now, all that's left is pushing out those gangsters for good. There was some kind of encrypted message on the network. Looks like a recording. Let me see that. Hmm. It's an old migrant merchant's guild code. I think I can decrypt it. Here we go. You accepted our friendships under the tail and credits. It's time you paid us back. All we want are the housing profits you promised our people now. Your people will have to wait their turn like everyone else. I owe you nothing. If you continue pushing me, I'll destroy you all. Should have known Senator Kale was too good to be true. She's an even bigger crook than I thought. Doesn't make sense. There's got to be an explanation. Your extortion attempt has failed. My people are pushing back your little army as we speak. It's over. Nobody breaks a deal with us, Senator. We'll have what we want, one way or another. This is way above my pay grade. I'm not destroying the reputation of Coruscant's most popular politician. Take the recording. I don't want it. I'll speak with her as soon as possible. She'll have a good explanation. She has to. Senator Kale has done great things for Coruscant. She's a good woman. Give her a chance. My men and I will stay down here. You should go back to the Senate Tower. Oh, crap. Gotta go up. Well, that ain't that bad, I guess. All right. Well, good thing I have my fast travel. Yeah, well, sorry to say your big crush of a senator is probably a little crooked. Not so straight-laced anymore, pal. Gotta go ahead and turn this in. Lots of, lots of, not a lot of talking needs to be done right now. We keep getting all these, we got all these quests to turn in. That will be all, Minister. Dismissed. Captain Winborn contacted me. You thwarted an attack that would have killed thousands. You have my gratitude. Unfortunately, you also have a hollow recording I would like destroyed. Its contents will only cause harm. You committed a crime, Senator. Do you really expect to get away with it? There's so much you don't understand about the situation. The Jedi Order left us to rebuild Coruscant alone. My opponent in the elections was a vile man. Lazy, stupid, and corrupt. He wasn't interested in building, only taking. I had to win, but I didn't possess as much wealth as he did. When those gangsters approached me, I accepted their donation, and I'd do it again. The people choose their leaders by popular vote. What difference did it make how many credits you had? Don't be naive. Wealth can purchase influence, and influence sways popular opinion. My opponent understood that too well. 
I stole from those criminals to rebuild Coruscant for its people. Set things right. I'll bring the Migrant Merchants Guild to justice. You hold the power to ensure my success. Let me finish healing this world. Please, destroy that recording. Uh, all right. You're all clear, Senator. Thank you. <coughs> I won't forget what you've done for me. For Coruscant. It was my pleasure. I hope we'll continue working closely. I promise you won't only hear from me when there's a crisis. I'll see to it you're properly recognized for your heroism in the old galactic market. Farewell. Hey. Hey. What can I say? Sometimes you have to play the system dirty, man, if you want to get things done. Alright, she sound you know, she didn't seem too evil. Alright, she just needed some money to win the election so she could actually get stuff done. Okay? I mean, that's what she told me. Alright? I don't see how that was really, like, a super evil option, but you know what? I'm not gonna fight it. I did what I did, and I'll do it again, dang it. I'll do it again. Oop. Whoops. Pressed the wrong button. Alright, guys. I'm getting into here, and when we come back, we will do some... Gree hydro supply leak fixin' and rescue the senator or doctor, whoever the heck. Peace off. Thanks for watching, everybody. If you liked the video, leave a like and make sure to share it around the internet and worldwide. You can check out my Patreon links in the description and on the screen now. Don't forget to come by our Discord and say hello to everybody. And last but not least, make sure to follow me on Facebook and Twitter. Peace out.